Hi, I'm Mervin from Data Semantics. Today, we'll be looking into Tableau's product portfolio. There are seven major products that Tableau offers for business intelligence and data visualization. I'll be giving you a quick overview of each. First product we'll be going over is Tableau Prep. Tableau Prep is the latest offering from Tableau and was officially launched in the year 2018. It is a desktop application meant for data preparation. Prior to its launch, when using Tableau, there would be a dependency on third-party ETL tools. With the launch of Tableau Prep, we can now combine data from different source systems, reshape it into the required format, and cleanse the data, thereby reducing the dependency on other third-party tools to an extent. Tableau Prep is available for the Windows and Mac operating systems. The next product is Tableau Desktop. As the name suggests, Tableau Desktop is a desktop application and is the primary tool provided by Tableau for data visualization. Using Tableau Desktop, we can connect to more than 60 different types of data sources, be it files, relational databases, cloud databases, or big data. We can build reports just by dragging and dropping the required fields into appropriate shelves provided within the application. We can then Combine these reports to build interactive dashboards or stories for getting better insights from the data. Once the dashboard or story is ready, it can then be exported or published to the various platforms available for hosting them. Tableau Desktop is again available for both the Windows and Mac operating systems. Once a dashboard or story is developed, it is necessary that it raise the audience it was created for. This can be achieved by means of the remaining five products in the list. These products are meant for sharing and collaborating with individuals, teams, or the entire organization. Tableau Server is the first in the list of tools for this purpose. Tableau Server is a web-based application meant for enterprises. It is used for hosting the Tableau workbooks developed using Tableau Desktop, which can then be accessed by licensed users online. Tableau Server can be installed on-premise or on the cloud, giving the organization complete control over the infrastructure. It is available for the Windows and Linux operating systems. Next, we have Tableau Online. Tableau Online is again a web-based application for enterprises and is more or less similar to Tableau Server in terms of functionality. The primary difference being that Tableau Online runs only on the cloud and is completely hosted by Tableau itself. This allows for organizations to avoid the costs associated with setting up of infrastructure themselves. The next product is Tableau Public. This product is not meant for enterprises and is rather for non-commercial purposes. It is used to share Tableau dashboards or stories to a public forum for the online community to view and interact with. The content hosted on Tableau Public can be accessed by everyone and there is no security mechanism available for restricting access. Next, we have Tableau Reader. Tableau Reader is used for opening and interacting with dashboards or stories contained in a Tableau packaged workbook. It does for a Tableau packaged workbook what a PDF reader would do for a PDF file. It is a desktop application and is available for the Windows and Mac operating systems. Finally, we have Tableau Mobile. As the name suggests, it's a mobile application and is available for both the Android and iOS operating systems. It enables users to connect to and interact with dashboards or stories deployed on Tableau Server as well as Tableau Online, thus allowing for access to content on the move and in the palm of your hands. This concludes the session on Tableau's product portfolio. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.